welcome back to my channel. Um, in the beginning of this, I did not put an intro, so I'm doing it now from the future during editing. Sorry about that. So, thanks. Starting with my eyebrows, I'm using my chocolate eyebrow pencil. I just recently got another one. Um, I used on my Fenty one. I think I told you guys that in a previous video. I noticed that um, it's a good eyebrow pencil. The Fenty MVP, I think, brow liner, I think it's the name. But I think for me, it's better if I have like a dip. Um, so I ordered something of that sort to have that. So right now I'm just using my chocolate pencil. My eyebrows is real struggle, it's real struggle in this video. But recently I just did them with a razor. Waiting for quarantine to be over so I can get my friend Jess to do my brows because they are struggling. So using the spoolie obviously to brush them out. Then we're gonna go in with the LA Pro Girl Concealer in the color Fawn of course with an angled brush, okay? We're gonna put that around our eyebrows until they look like this. I'm trying this new thing, so I tried tape. One, to make more of like a cut angle, and two, to help maybe like reduce some fallout because I'm gonna be honest, I did not like this makeup look <laughs> at all. But here's the thing, normally when I don't like my makeup looks, I wipe them all off. Which I wasn't doing that this time. I was just like, you know what, no. I'm not wiping this off. I'm just going to keep going. So throughout the video, you are going to actually see me get agitated and make faces. That's why. <laughs> so I'm going in with um, the Ace of Beauty palette. Going to use that first um, reddish, pinkish, orangey color. Put that in my crease. And then smoke it out a little bit. Like I said, y'all, the look I was going for, I really don't even remember. Like, I think I was just winging it. I just wanted to do an eye look. And then I was trying to play off the colors of my shirt just a little bit. But then I started to feel like they did start to look Christmassy. Well, I didn't. My cousin said they started to look Christmassy. So then I was just like, mm, kind of, sort of. Maybe not picking that up in the camera. But when I was doing it, it was definitely looking kind of. Christmas holiday like so I'm just gonna keep doing that and then once we go to the next color I'll come back on here just keep watching okay so I'm going into the matte bulk and I'm using those three greens the center green first then the darker green then on the outer corner of my eye the light green like I said I did not like this makeup look I won't keep saying it but I just didn't like it, but I was like, if I wipe this off, I'm not redoing a makeup look. Like, it's, it's just not happening. So I just kept it on there, and I just kept blending, and I started, I do believe I started with the middle one, or I might have started with the darkest color, then the middle color, then the lightest. I just kept kind of going back and forth until I liked it. Um, yeah, so I did, I'm sorry, so I did do the darker color first, then I did the lighter color, the middle color. Then on the ends, I did the lighter color, if that makes sense. Sorry if that's all over the place, but yeah. somewhere along the lines in that sequence. <laughs> so, yeah, I tried to get it to do what I needed it to do, but I was kind of struggling. But anyway, yeah, that's what I used. And then um, I'll eventually remove the tape. You guys will see that once you see I remove the tape, it's going to get that sharp line. Now, putting the whole tape on your face is kind of, like, annoying. Well, it was for me. It was, like, irritating my eyes and my lashes. <laughs> that was a phase of irritation. But, um, <laughs> yeah, just keep watching. So, you know, I was cutting that crease. <laughs> I got the LA Pro Girl Concealer in the color Fun, of course. Cutting the crease as always, or I guess the beginning part of the crease. Went to my Jackiana and Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. And I am taking out the color. Uh, which one is that? 
Uh, I think it's lituation. Oh, no, no, no. That I think that's trust issues. That's trust issues. I was trying it. And I don't really care for it. And this is when I really started to be like, I don't know what I'm doing. So I just went back into, I do believe the Ace of Beauty palette is what I went back into. And I just pulled from there like this peachy, pinkish color. Just to kind of like, because here's the thing. I don't, I think I have to just get some eyeshadow. I know people use concealer. Either I'm not doing it correctly or I just need to go ahead and get eyeshadow primer or something. Because I don't know. It just seems like I don't get it to dry down that great. And then it makes it hard for my palette. It's like, uh, even down to like my Patricia Bite and Makeup Revolution collaboration. Like, some of hers are, eyeshadows were like a creamy base. So, even with trying to put that on top of the concealer, it would kind of, like, make it look weird. Like, you get what I'm saying? I don't know if that makes sense, but it would kind of, like, give a texture on my eyelid. Even though I don't have texture on my eyelid to where it looks like it's not, the formulas can't mesh well. I don't know. It's weird. But, um, I'm going to try to go ahead and get some P. Louise, um, eyeshadow primer base stuff and go from there so i'm just putting in that peachy pinky color at this point my food as you can see the red lobster is present ready to throw down so i'm just finishing up here um so yeah just keep watching i think after this i take the tape off and then i'm gonna go ahead and prime my face with um the milk uh, hydro grip primer then on top of that, I put some of that um, e.l.f. putty primer, and then I start putting on my foundation, concealing, contouring. So I'm going to just let you guys finish watching the rest of that, and you'll see that I put my eyelashes on as well.
So here's the finishing look. I loved how it turned out. You know, lashes always save the day. It was cute. I went with the shirt, which I was trying to do. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. If you guys have any other palettes in this video, comment down below which one you have or if you're willing to try it. And yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Thank you.